episode, we pretended that we owned a piece of Paris, some Paris property, and we walked down the street, we checked out a few stores, went into, we found this awesome boulangerie on the corner, we went into a monoprix, got some Réblouchon cheese made with raw milk. There are some people that are saying that fermented food is supposed to be really, really good for you, and... That's one of the reasons why the French are so healthy. So if you subscribe to that philosophy, uh, cheese made with raw milk is about as good as you can get. All right, anyways. Then we found a cafe in the corner called the Royal Cafe. But uh, right now we're in a, the Rond Point, just across the street. What's especially cool about having this Rond Point right here is... You can explore each separate street, go off into an entirely different part of Paris, and still have a great idea of where we are. And guess what? We're back. <laughs> okay, ready for our little adventure? On y va. That was quick, and we are we are going to walk down the other direction there. Okay, there's our favorite monoprix, and there's the fabulous boulangerie that we discovered last time. This is our street. Look familiar? Paris has many dimensions to it. And uh, the 17th has its own personality, and it's really one of the best kept secrets of, um, of Paris. It's a very residential, non touristy type of neighborhood. And we're going to check that out right now. Uh oh, ladies, do you see what I see? Now hit a public thoroughfare. This is Avenue Wacom. Okay. All right. So we're gonna look left, and we're gonna look right, and look what we see there. Right behind me, right there is the Arc de Triomphe. So we know over there is the Champs Elysees, one of the most famous avenues in the world. It's touristy, it's wonderful, it's a lot of fun. So instead of going right, let's go left and see what we can see. All right. Thank you. 
Yep, the Haasman architecture in this neighborhood is unbelievable. We were walking down Avenue Wakam. I saw a map that said Park Manso is real close by. So we are on a mission to find Park Manso. So let's go. Now we've been walking around for about 10, 15 minutes and it looks like Park Manso is right over there. So let's check it out. I don't know about you, but I am a sucker for these Art Nouveau Metro stops. The style is about 100 years old, but it's timeless. All right, we're here, Park Monceau. Let's check it out. was replanted during the Houseman renovation about 150 years ago. And it's a really cool place for kids, a good place to relax, very conducive to a nice, easy afternoon. Speaking of which, I brought myself a sandwich. I think I'm gonna have my dejeuner right here. All right, until next time, au revoir.